there, it's Dr. Jen from Impact Ortho and today we're talking about the very important question, are braces expensive? <laughs> well, this is very hard to talk about because expensive is a word that everybody uses differently. So what I'm going to do uh, to the best of my ability in this video is explain for you the cost of orthodontics and where that comes from and some of the things that we do in our office to help it feel maybe not so expensive if that's feeling expensive to you. So there is a range of fees that happen in orthodontics. So for some people, they need something very simple like a retainer. And so that would be relatively inexpensive if we want to use that word. So maybe something in the mouth that costs somewhere between $500 and $1,000. And then there is all the way up to the most complex, complicated type of care where we're moving teeth and bones and bites and all of it. And we, that could be upwards of $10,000. So there is a very wide range of the fees that could be needed for orthodontic treatment. And these fees, I think, are fairly standard across the city of Calgary. So if you're looking locally here, it would be usually somewhere between $500 and $10,000, depending on what needs to be done. I know that's a giant range. You really do need to see an orthodontist to find out how much it will cost for yourself or your children to have orthodontics in your area. Uh, the new patient consultations almost everywhere that I know of are free. There's no charge to come in to have a chat and have a discussion about what needs to be done and how much it's going to cost. Now, one thing that's really nice to understand is that one of the main reasons for doing orthodontics for children and adults is to put their teeth in the best possible location for long-term health of their teeth and their bites. That means teeth that are straight, so they look beautiful, but also functional. They are biting against each other where they should be. Now, the reason for this is that it will, yes, have a beautiful smile for a lifetime. We want to be attractive all the way throughout. That's fine. But also functional, which means the wear and breakdown of our teeth should be reduced. Straight teeth are easier to brush and floss, which means we have less cavities. Straight teeth who, that bite together correctly are also less likely to cause to be damaged over time with chips and cracks, which means things like crowns and other fillings don't need to be done as often. So by having orthodontics done to your teeth and your bite, then there should be far less dental care that needs to happen over your lifetime. I think for the average person, that's actually quite a savings. I'll give you an example. Let's say you have one molar that had a filling and then a bigger filling and then needed a crown. You could easily spend anywhere between $2,000 and $10,000 on one tooth over your lifetime, depending on the state of that tooth and what has to happen to it. Orthodontics in general is moving all of your teeth into a better position. And we do all of that for somewhere between $500 and $10,000. <laughs> and that is done in a concise period of time and then you get retainers to hold them there. So the benefits of having orthodontics does save you money in the long run. That's one of the big reasons why we do it. There are some ways that orthodontics can be made more affordable. Most offices offer financing in their office, either in-house or through another party. And that means that if your child is going to be in orthodontics for let's say two years, you could pay for the orthodontics over two years or even longer to split it out into smaller monthly payments so that it doesn't have to be let's say six or $7,000 all at once up front. A lot of people have dental insurance and dental insurance may not cover 100% of the cost of orthodontics, but often it takes a big chunk out of it. And so if you've got some insurance through your workplace, fantastic, that will take some of the bill down. And when you come to our office, we're always happy to tell you how much your insurance will cover and then how much you would be responsible for. And so there are lots of ways to make orthodontics affordable. We actually pride ourselves in our office on also working with every government agency and every funding program that's possible for families that really can't afford orthodontics to make it affordable because there are programs out there that will pay for orthodontics for children. And so we're always happy to do that as well. We like to say that we can find a way to make it affordable for any family that comes in to see us. I hope that helps on the expense of orthodontics. If you're curious about yourself or your children, just make sure you go see your local orthodontist to find out exactly what needs to be done and how much it would cost and seek multiple opinions. There's nothing wrong with that. Um, everyone does things a little bit differently and so find a place that feels good and that you're comfortable at. I hope you have a wonderful day. Bye-bye.